first location is the, I think she was a QC, and I think it was episode, sorry, series two, Broadchurch. And uh, if you go and check it out, that's where the uh, QC barrister lady was living. Lovely looking house, right on the East Cliff as well. Super. This is East Cliff, looking out towards West Cliff and West Bay Harbour. I think they use a lot of like picture scenes here for promotion. Um, I'll try and put the bits on that we need to the video so you can see them in comparison. So this bit is the end of the pier and majority of the filming was done for, again, promotional, just so they could get, stand in the circle really and get that cliff behind him because that cliff that's everybody remembers that cliff from Broadchurch everyone thinks of Broadchurch when they're looking at that cliff and this is the circle where they did a lot of TV promotion looking over to East Beach so at the bottom there we've got Windy Corner Cafe which during season, well series one the interior is used at that time though it was called Ellipse Cafe. Now it's Windy, Windy Corner Cafe. So yeah, the interior is used a lot during filming. So this building was used for the Wessex Police Station in Broadchurch. So I think it was used throughout all series. Now it's like a, an apartment. But yeah, you'll see now that's the what was used for the police station I think it used to a couple of years back I still had the, like the sign up for it and then you'll see these steps which had a lot of filming done and you were stood on these steps arguing without possibly series Yeah, series three. Where they were stood on these steps, and he was—it's uh, was like a protest—and he marched throughout the harbour. And there's the harbour. Do you remember it was like a torchlight procession, which Bridport does have? And it's actually on a Sunday evening, I think it's like class to last Sunday before the bank holiday, so it'll be tomorrow night. But yeah, in the, uh, in the programme it was used as a torchlight procession. Just across the River Brit there, at the, well, right at the harbour still, but you'll see that the Blue Hull was used by Hardy for his home, I think that was in series two. Um, me and Mrs. B and the family have been coming down here for like 14 years and was actually here on site when they was filming that. It was uh, very strange to see David Tennant walking around being filmed over there. But yeah, we're just right now at the harbour. So that's where that location is. you know okay so that's harbour amusements and the interior was used for the uh, newspaper office so back in series one this is slap bang in the middle of west bay center so where it says gifts ice cream and news that news agents that was used um, in series one. The now Discovery Centre was used for the Sea Brigade Hall in uh, series one, where he very nearly lynched. I think he's, was it Jack Marshall? The chap? So, yeah, now it's a Discovery Centre. But this is just leading us up to East Beach.
the watch house traffic was used in series 3 uh, where Olivia Coleman was sat in the open bit having a cup of tea, cup of coffee with the victim Hopefully you can hear me, it's really windy but this is East Cliff right ahead of us and there's lots of film here because it's where Danny Miller's body was found in the very first episode it's quite a high cliff seas are raging today yeah lots of scenes filmed here and obviously on the coming from the car park all the way up beautiful so here we are East Cliff just a little bit closer in you can see the height now sea raging right next to me you can see quiet as she is so picturesque absolutely gorgeous just got to be really careful not really to be lagging below these or some baby because we have lots of rock falls here in West Bay so yeah, it's a bit more of a close-up where Danny Miller was found on this beach. So this is the hut that you see uh, David Tennant and Olivia Coleman sign uh, in a certain scene. And then again, another promotional uh, video. So yeah, it's right next to the, the beach. And then you've got the cliff just behind again. So yeah, there's the, the hut on the beach, well on the pier. So, I hope you enjoyed that. A little walk around the bay, showing you some of the uh, locations of the Broad Church series. Uh, Abby was, came along, Mrs B was recorded. Well, actually, I think I recorded all of it. The, Mrs B and Abby just walked behind me, didn't speak, and get involved. So it's all about me doing this one. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching.